morning, Bumblebeezies. Happy Friday. Uh, it is early. It is 7.47 right now. I'm here with Callie. Callie! Callie can now jump on the couch. She can jump on the chair, the dining chair. She actually surprised me yesterday because she was able to jump onto our bed and our bed is pretty high But I think she might have I didn't see how she did it, but I'm thinking she actually probably like Used the bed frame like as a stepping stool Maybe because our bed is like so high like I have no idea how she would have done it, but Yeah, Callie can jump <laughs> Um I still haven't put away the Halloween decorations, but look, we're making progress. I have the bins. <laughs> I had, um, I asked AJ to help me get the bins out of the garage. So we're going to do that today for sure. Um, and it's so cold. Oh my gosh, you guys. It's so cold. It's so cold inside the house, we had to turn the heater on, but I'm only gonna turn it on for just a little bit, just to warm up the house a little bit, because it's like 67 degrees inside, and I don't want Callie to be cold, I mean, and I'm cold, so. We live, I don't know if you guys remember last year, it actually snowed that one day, <laughs> but um, we live at a higher elevation, and there's a big mountain behind our house, and there's already snow on top of that mountain, and we also live pretty close to Big Bear, and there's already snow over there in Big Bear, so that's exciting. I'm going to use this mug today. Disneyland. I don't know if we're going to go to Disneyland during the holiday season. That was my original plan, like I really wanted to go during the holidays. Um, but with the price increases, the increase in the, um, what is it, the lightning lane went up. It's just so expensive right now and then we have our Seattle trip coming up at the end of January so I think what we're gonna do is we're probably most likely going to skip out the holiday season this year and we are thinking of going after our Seattle trip because they're also going to be celebrating a hundred years of Disney and the what is it? The Mickey and Mickey, Min, Mickey and Minnie's Rail, Runaway Railway. I think that ride opens on my birthday. And I think the whole celebration starts on my birthday. But anyways, the ride is going to be opening. So we figured let's just wait for that. So probably after our Seattle trip, we will plan a Disneyland day. Just a day, most likely just a day. Well... Maybe one or two days. Because it's always a better deal to buy multiple days. But we'll see. I do want to go to Downtown Disney though. Sometime in December, I think we're going to go. Once Callie is fully vaccinated, which will be in a couple of weeks, um, I want to take her to daycare so she can kind of, you know, be introduced to that and kind of start getting used to that. And then sometime in December, we're going to go to Downtown Disney. I really wish she could come, but Disney doesn't allow dogs, even though it's outdoors. Today's creamer is going to be frosted sugar cookie. She does have an appointment uh, for the groomer, but it's her first time going to the groomer, and so they recommended just their little tidy service, so it's not like the full groom. Um, so we're going to do that. And then maybe her next one she can... Um, get the full groom. She does need a haircut. Her hair is getting really long. But with the tidy, I believe it's just a bath, a brush, and then just um, they're going to trim like hair around her face if she needs it. She does also need her nails trimmed, but I think I'm just going to have the vet do it because she has an appointment with the vet in a couple of weeks. What is she doing? Let's take our coffee. Let's go find this girl. What she? What is she doing? Oh my gosh. Um, how did you get that? Excuse me. 
Excuse me, Callie, that's not yours. How did you even get that? How did you get that? Let me show you guys where we keep this. Actually, oh my gosh, Callie. Callie, it's normally up here. Now, I don't know if she pulled it down or if someone left it down there, but she loves slippers. You love slippers? That's not for you. You're not supposed to play with that. You're not supposed to play with that. Okay? Silly girl. Uh-uh, no. Come on, Callie. Let's go. Come on. Let's go over here. Callie, are you going to help me put away the Halloween decorations? Are you going to help? What the? Callie. Callie. I guess that's a no. <laughs> so anyways, I am going to put away the Halloween decorations. It shouldn't take long because we really don't have that many. Um, and then I also need to wrap and put away the Halloween mugs. I forgot we also have this that I need to put away. So this might, I think this would probably just take me the longest because I need to figure out how to put it back into the styrofoam. This year to save me from tears, I'll give it to someone special. Come on. Last Christmas. Ow! Okay, okay! Golly! <laughs>
Halloween decorations put away. Look at that. Looks so plain. Look at her daddy's girl. So Alfredo went to Cardina's to get some tamales. He left at like 11. And they were already, I think he, what time did you get there? 11, 20, something yeah. like that? They were already sold out. Yep. That's crazy. A early. Gotta go at 8 a.m. They open at 7, but she said they, the tamales are usually ready by like 8. So anyways, instead, he just got a plate of birria. This is beef birria, not like, is it usually like goat, like yeah. traditionally? But nowadays, a lot of places just make it with beef, right? So yeah, birria, beans and rice, and then there's tortillas. You could do like little tacos. Yep. And then in here, she put it in a cup, but it's actually a um, chili relleno. I can't open it. <laughs> yeah. It's really good, actually. I tried it, yeah. Hi guys, we have a birthday shout out for a good friend, Elizabeth. She's turning 30 on Sunday. Happy birthday. <laughs> <laughs> we have a birthday shout out for Elizabeth. Happy birthday, Happy Elizabeth. Birthday. It's her birthday on Sunday. <laughs> I hope you have super fun time at your birthday party tomorrow. And I hope you have a great, you know, just a great birthday weekend. And the whole, and I hope my, uh, uh, my team, the Raiders, win on your birthday. So. <laughs> So, happy birthday, Elizabeth. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Hey. How about from Steuben? Happy birthday. Oh, wow. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. And from Cali. Happy birthday from Cali. <laughs> Alfredo and I just got back from the grocery store. We had to go get... He just looked at me like, excuse me. Papa Bear and I... We just got back from the grocery store. It's so funny because I had planned on making pancet tonight, but I literally had none of the ingredients. All I had was the noodles. So I got a little rotisserie chicken. I'm gonna shred that and we're gonna put that in the pancet. And then I also needed chicken broth. And I like to use coleslaw mix instead of cutting my own carrots and cabbage. That's a pro tip for you guys. Get yourself a bag of coleslaw mix, and then you can also add, um, you can also buy the bag of shredded carrots because this doesn't really have a lot of carrots. So if you want more carrots, get the bag of shredded carrots. We got some cookies for the kids. Well, for everyone. We're gonna try this beer. We've never tried this one before, and we love hazy IPAs. This one is um, a tropical hazy IPA with tangerine and pineapple. Sounds good, huh? Not bad. Hey, she might scene. fall in the sink. And then I saw these. I've never tried this before. Let me know if you guys have tried this. It's the Ritz covered, fudge covered. Is it good? It sounds good to me. Salty and sweet. Okay, and then we just got, we were running low on our Louisiana hot sauce, so I picked up Red Rooster this time. It's always like this, between this, Louisiana brand, or Crystal. So we got that. We want to try this, Tabasco Sriracha. Have you guys tried this before? We're going to try that. Okay, and that's it. I would say we were good together. Breaking 
panza is cooked. I totally forgot the chicken and I only remembered the chicken at the very end. Uh, but if you're making this, go ahead and put the chicken with the vegetables. But it's fine. I mean, it, it doesn't really make that much of... It doesn't really make a difference at all. But, yeah. Okay, panza is done. Also, I'm sorry for the angle change. It's because I needed my air fryer and that's what I had you guys on top of. So I switched it to the rice cooker instead. That's why it was lower. Um, but we have some french fries in the air fryer. These are the ones we got at Trader Joe's yesterday. Mm -hmm. 